Hi ladies, I've got another collection of mixes for you today and um, this is the Super Mario collection. So the first one I've got is based on Rosalina and we haven't unlocked her yet but it was not easy to try and capture her colour because she's a pale blue but a slight, slight greenish hue to her, sort of a um, little bit turquoise but very pale so we did our best. It's got lots of silver, um, yeah, so that's Rosalina. Sorry, daylight's fading, so um, I'm not sure how good this is going to be, but we'll do our best. Alright, next we have one of Max's personal favourites, King Boo. And he's predominant, the mix is predominantly white, but it's got some pink for his tongue and um, a bit of black for his eyes, gold for his crown, and then there are some blues, greens and reds for the little gems in his crown. So that is King Boo. We've unlocked him as far as I know. Um, then we have Princess Daisy, which we haven't unlocked and probably never will because a lot of the characters um, require you to play as one of the female characters a certain amount of times to unlock other characters. So anyway, this is Daisy. Um, I wanted to get sort of an orangey yellow for her um, base and then there are darker bits of orange and then there are, of course, little daisies. Um, the sort of blue colour is for her jewellery. Um, yeah. So that's Daisy. It's quite a bit brighter than what it's showing up. But, I mean, there are f um, photos on the Store Envy, on my Store Envy store. So, yeah, it's a little bit better. Yeah, it's marginally better. Okay, and here we've got Princess Peach. So she's a light coloured pink with some darker pink for her dress and then gold for her crown and what else? Um, sort of blue for her jewellery. So, okay, where are we? There is Peach. And here's her mix again. Um... Let's see, that's, yeah, when the um, indoor light hits it, it looks kind of a bit more yellowy than what it is. But that's not too bad. The pictures that Andrew took and put on the Store Envy site are, I'd say, reason, yeah, I'd say they're actually really quite close to what they look like, depending on your monitor. So we have Wario. Um... I didn't want to put much yellow in, so I just I mainly did him purple and with a bit of green. Tied in his shoes like that. I can get him open. And this is Wario. There's a little bit of blue because of the W on his hat and glove. And um, yeah, there's a lot of the there's some opaque green mylar, um, different purples and um, blues. There's a few blues. I don't think I put any yellows in there though. Um, oh, I put some of these round, um, green round, uh, what do you call them? Uh, round spangles. There's some. There they are. Oops. Sorry, my tripod is not very steady. There's Wario. And of course, you can't have Wario without Waluigi. I think Andrew quite likes playing as Waluigi. So it's sort of, I basically did a purple and blue mix and then I did a bit of gold in there as well. So here he is. What I liked about this one is that the um, 
you can sort of see on the side that, no, you can't really tell. But the purple and the blue didn't really mix in together. They sort of stay separate and that doesn't often happen. So I was really happy with that. Um, some large hexes and there's also some rhombuses in there. But that's Waluigi. Toad and Toadette. So I did her quite a bit darker than Peach because she is. And then I put in some white and a little bit of red and gold maybe. So I used some, no I didn't use opaque. I used some of the opaque white glitter dots. Um, the Mylar is the translucent kind. So she's pretty chunky but a lot of the stuff tends to sit on the top. So, um, see, there's a ton of fine glitter. You just have to keep mixing it up. Mm, a red heart jumped out at me. Most of these have got spangles, so I think she's got red hearts to tie in with the red on her coat. And some holographic rhombuses. And then we have Toad. Now he's a little bit different from King Boo. He doesn't have, um, well anyway, there's King Boo and then there's Toad. So Toad's got a lot more red and blue. Um, yeah, because he's got the, the, the red and gold, the red and white obviously and then the gold and the blue on his coat. Um, yeah, there are some spangles and put the opaque white glitter dots in him as well. Where's my stick on? Yeah. So see, he's got a decent amount of fine glitter there, but it just all sort of sinks to the bottom. So that's Toad. And we have Mario and Luigi. this without knocking the camera over. So Mario is predominantly red but he's got a lot of gold and blue and a little bit of black in there as well for his moustache. Um, there's quite a bit of fine glitter in there but the chunks just tend to sit up on the surface. So there's Mario. And Luigi I chose to do mostly blue with some green. Um, so he turned out kind of a, a teal colour, like a much darker version of Rosalina. And there's some stars and um, I think I used silver instead of gold with him, I don't know. But anyway, there's Luigi. And the last two in this collection we have Koopa Trooper and Yoshi. So Koopa Trooper is mainly yellow but there's bits of green and red and you know white in there for his other colours. Um, yeah, I mean, look, I wasn't massively, massively thrilled with how he turned out, but he's not too bad. He's pretty close to um, what he looks like, so, yeah. And there's plenty of fine glitter in there as well. It's quite a fluffy one. But yeah, that's Cooper Trooper. And Yoshi, mostly green. I think the light's washing it out a bit. Um, it's not that 
much of a warm green but it's not that either sort of in between anyway so he's got some white in there and um, orange for his little spines and boots and red for his mouth some little spangles so anyway thank you for watching I'll link my store down below and um, yeah please go check out my Super Mario mixes. Bye!